my mom is Wendy. That's me. I'm the camera girl. <laughs> and light girl. <laughs> so we're going to do room by room tours of our 40 room dollhouse that you've seen in the first video. If you haven't, check the link down below. This is our crazy doll room. Pretty big. Gracie's turning on some lights. Yay. As you can see, it's quite the adventure. Excuse us while we get used to um, figuring out how to do videos. We've never done that. So we're gonna, whoops, just stepped into the ice. We are going to start off with the first piece we made, which is this piece here. It's the schoolhouse with the garage and the scaras. So we'll go first into here. Okay, there is an overview of the room. Looking pretty good, pretty detailed. Mm -hmm. Very. Okay, we'll start off with the dolls. Um, Gracie had some mm -hmm. when she was younger. A couple. Which ones are those? Which is Spectra, the body and the head, because they're both different. Um, I had a pair of the clothing, Halloween, uh, sort of Jackie, Laura, and um, Frankie. Uh, a little bit of operetta and mostly Abby. Yeah, the only way Abby we had to change her head because Gracie had cut off the hair. Yeah, I was trying to make a request here to go. <laughs> yeah, <it's in> <laughs> operetta's hair was quite a mess and the scar yeah. was all pinned in. Of course, she was a lot younger then. Now she respects her dolls and doesn't do that. I learned my lesson. Yes, I you did. did. And operetta was my first try at fixing a doll's hair. I think I did a pretty good job. So, for this tour, I think we'll start over here. We got the copier. Mm -hmm. That is a company that is called Gloria. Gloria. That thing was we got on eBay. TK Trading is pretty good. They have really good prices. Yeah. This thing can open. Oh, yeah. I just noticed that little um, foot. Um, mm hmm Switch. We just use some. We have uh, done scrapbooking, so we just use some scrapbooking just supplies to make with stamps to make it look like. There's photocopies, and we use lots of scrapbooking supplies. We have a couple things yeah. that I think are imperative for this project that I will show a picture of later caulking in this particular primer that works good on the plastic for so you can paint things like this. Mm -hmm. This thing, the copier, came with that table set with the chair and the computer from the office, and I think it was less than $10. Just got to work on it a little that bit. That is very cute. Let me just move Laguna so I can show yep. you guys. We got her from an auction. Yeah, I mean, you made her bow. Yeah, she didn't have her. I mean, her flower. flower <laughs> which whoops. We just put on a little band that was for something else and painted it up to look like it because mm -hmm. to buy that separately and loose is for a little too above our yeah, price Mama range. Yeah, Mom also fixed her hair. Yeah, we fixed her hair. It was we a little bit messy. We kept her hood off because she had this. So. Yeah, she looks much much prettier. Oh, and wax. Wax. And wax has wax. been our friend. And wax like this is our whole friend. Entire dog. Museum wax. I had never heard of it. And you can stick anything and it's replaceable and it doesn't leave much of a mess and mm -hmm. it keeps things in place because mm -hmm. we're always, of course, knocking stuff over. <laughs> it's nice not to. Yeah. <laughs> These decals, <laughs> that was one set that was for the walls, the electrostatic stuff. And it had tons of good things. And we've scattered stuff from that pack all over the place. It would actually peel off, but I put a little glue on it just to make it a little sturdier. Mm -hmm. Okay, over here, what do we got? The owl is actually part of one of Mom's broken jewelry. Yeah, we kind of repurposed that. Mm -hmm. The flag was, um, having flag. done this over two years. Yeah, and we had the idea for a flag since every single classroom that I've been in had a flag. Yeah, and if you're through the holidays, so such a time, we kept our eye out specifically, get them on sale afterwards, mm -hmm. and then we just used some Play-Doh to make a little pedestal. Mm -hmm. That um, trash can, we have lots of those. Those are little... Yeah, we have one right here. Shot, shot glasses. From where I used to work, we got them all and used them as trash cans. Then we have over here is... The lead head 
Headmistress oh. Headless Bloodgood. Headmistress Bloodgood. I can't really say her name. And this is actually a chalkboard that can work out of chalkboard paint. Yeah, we had that around the house because we did some chalkboard projects here, so that mm -hmm. came in handy. Yeah, they're big together. Mom. Gracie made some awesome little, if you can see her little green chalks there and her little pencils she did. Mm -hmm. Shout out to my froggy stuff. Yes, Miss Gracie loves my froggy stuff. And we just subscribed to her. She, We got a couple more ideas, like the she mop we want to like, make of hers. That person is like amazing. Yeah, she does excellent stuff. Just a little idea here and the cups and anything and bowls, we use puffy paint. We just fill them with puffy paint so they actually look like they have something in them. Mm -hmm. Which just adds um, a little more dimension. Mm -hmm. And this is like uh, 60, about 63 or 64 characters like, like... School portraits. Yeah, like through, whoops, this line was not like here and this line with the New Yorks. When we started the project, yeah. that's where how many there were. Can you move the chandelier a little bit so we can? And it just dropped a thing on accident. Mm. That happens. Yeah, and I so don't we're up to date went. besides Valentine and Wisp. We mm -hmm. haven't put those and the in. Great Scary Reef, but that's coming out later. Yeah. And the trophy trophy, which yeah, is trophies, probably my favorite. Some we got from the schoolhouse, some we've gotten in lots. We buy lots of lots. Um, where you get tons of stuff and just make use mm -hmm. and we've been able to spread them out and There's do it like very inexpensively. There's thing on that thing over there, but I dropped it somewhere. Mm -hmm. Interesting here, that know, fire pole, that. <laughs> that's Tan's Craft off eBay. He's a cool seller. He's got lots mm -hmm. of um, yeah, metal like things. Yeah, they're scattered all over the place. Yeah, they're scattered. Yeah, there used to be like a pencil dropper over there. But yeah, that's actually over here. That was another thing yeah. from him, the pencil sharpener. Yeah, it was over here at first, but yeah. it kept falling off. So I guess it was a little bit too heavy for the museum wax. And the little switch plates, those came from, and I mean, they are really inexpensive. They're metal. You can use this primer, I'll show you, that you can prime them and just paint them up. The Salem's signs, and a lot of these are just things you get out of those magazines that sell signs and things. Um, catalogs and we just cut them out and put some glue on like decoupage on a piece of cardboard cut them out and we made signs for free really mm -hmm. <laughs> which is pretty cool mom actually got a map from this video game of monster high mm -hmm. we just made use of that and yeah. adds for extra decoration mom like curled it if it was old like, yeah it was old and the exit sign you can if you want things to be shiny you just put a piece of packing tape well, it's on just it started to peel just a little bit on the old exit just made it look a little old. No, the um, exit sign. Oh, is it? Yeah, like the top is. It probably needs to get pushed down. But if you put a little piece of packing tape on top before you cut it, it makes it a little sturdier and gives you a shiny finish so it won't get scratched. Yeah, because um, you do not like things getting scratched. Yeah, all these. Not fancy. That was a decoupage from um, catalogs. These frames were pretty uh, inexpensive from Michaels. Yeah, so shout out to Michaels. <laughs> yeah, I got a little Michaels spray paint them, and then we put puffy paint on them just to give them I, a little uh, more dimension. I did the, um, taking out the tags. Yeah, she did, Gracie did a lot of work on these. And uh, some of them we put the puffy paint, <clears throat> excuse me, and then we spray painted it, and then it all looked the same. Um, this, you can see, is from the the lockers and the door and this big gigantic desk and this computer desk and these desks and some of these desks we got a few extra more came from came from the monster high schoolhouse that actually i think broke i think yeah something happened yeah, to it something happened to it or we just destroyed it because we wanted some of the pieces yeah well it's kind of wobbly yeah, and I like that mom actually put like trees back here. Yeah, to make it look more like you can't see, but there's actually plastic there first. So it actually has like three dimension going on there uh, in person. And Alex did all the cutting, which is pretty amazing. Um, and all this trim work he did too to make it kind of blend in. So he's not into the monster highs and all that, but he certainly has helped us a lot with the hard yeah. woodworking project. And uh thing yeah. and all those doorways all the doorways in this house is like hard to do well he did that with wood this one was done with caulking it's it's put your finger on it grace it's actually texturized it's not flat and it's not painted flat it's you use caulking kind of like frosting yeah. and you build it on there and let it dry and then put a faux 
stone look to it, a little varnish, and then you have that. You have that. I'm pretty proud of that. I worked hard on that, and it really made that arch. I wanted that metals. door to look really a good. A lot of metals, actually. Yeah, a lot of metals. They all came <laughs> on the lots. You're right. Um, yes, they won the Olympics. <laughs> Alex did a lot of the door trim or the bottom baseboard for us, which made extra. And then we have that um, wallpaper border trim which is for regular people houses but it worked as wainscoting she's right and then we got one roll that we did most of the ceilings with a textured wallpaper i don't know if you can see it in the camera but it actually is light cream i don't even i can't even see it maybe my eyes are just playing tricks yeah we or... didn't want it to be bright white because it is monstery of course trim work yeah. you can get at any um building shop i think Lowe's was our favorite all these little trim works that are here just added a lot to it we wanted very detail whatever everybody knows where you can get trim uh, the monster high letters i think a lot of that came from mm -hmm. um, michaels michaels and we tried to do initials to personalize so each of the characters yes. have so i think lastly over here is oh, that and the coffee, and the showing coffee. oh the desk okay gracie wants to show you that that was part of the schoolhouse. Yeah, this is this was a handlebar, but Mom cocked it. Yeah, we cocked it and did a little faux wood, put a little varnish on the top. And she actually cocked the holes and actually painted the materials. Like, for example, this is actually a pencil. Yeah. You can see the eraser and the point. Yeah, she's saying that we oh. just... Whoops, there goes Halloween. Gracie made all these things in the beginning. She's Her spelling's gotten better in her writing. Yeah. But we keep those because it's really cute. I used to write like really small. Yeah, so that's how I can like do this. We love seeing her little stuff in there that it she's grown up seats. and changed. Mm -hmm. So they all have their own books and their tests. And... Yeah, and they used to be Barbie things. You might be able to see them on camera. I don't know, especially Spectra as you can really see. Can. Yeah, on camera you can see it a little bit, but she has the, but she... Her book has the um, Barbie logo on it. Yeah, but from far away. That's why some, we used a lot of Barbie stuff, getting in lots and really cheap and auctions mm -hmm. and patiently, and it made it look more. We want to put a little bit more on these shelves later. Yeah. Um, we also have all the binders except irises, which is in her bed. Because it's so pretty. Of course, the flooring was just regular people-sized flooring. We just picked and had fun choosing all different ones. Yeah, and we're all really clumsy sometimes. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure we are. The wax helps, but it doesn't help yeah. them from falling over. Yeah. Um, if you have sometimes any more questions, um, asking if we can offer you any ideas or whatever, let us know in the comments. We'll answer as soon as we can. The lights were done, and they are bright. When you hit it on the wrong angle, LEDs, oh, yeah. they're just Christmas lights. And we drilled a hole, uh, put a little puffy paint like, around sadly, it. Before the before these lights, they actually went out. Yeah, they were the really cheap ones, and they lasted yeah. about a year and a bit. Yeah. Then and we had to then we had to take everything out and replace yeah, it. Yeah, that was not fun at all. I was yeah. not thrilled. So, and so oh. this is also from Scaris area. Yeah, we got some different colors in there mm -hmm. to be creative. So I really like the fire frame. We hope you enjoyed this room by room tour, and we are key. Stay tuned. We're mm -hmm. gonna do room by room more and of course we got lots going on here i think coming up next is going to be scarus yeah and of course there we did take out the beach if you've seen from the first video so we got that downstairs to finish it up and everybody's waiting to go in it that'll be about two weeks before the we're rv done. just turned to a hot mess and don't forget to subscribe thank you so much for the and people share. who watched our first video we really appreciate that it makes us feel like people enjoyed our art Gracie's cleaning up what I kicked over. <laughs> and um, we are super buddies. Hope you enjoy the rest of our videos. Have a good day. Bye-bye.